Oh my. Hey guys, we're going to fish to Fletcher's Beach just north of Hutchinson Island and down from Bathtub Beach. Looks like it's going to be a low tide. We're fighting these thunderstorms because they're coming in pretty quick. So today we're going to throw Made Here in Jensen Beach, Pen Lures by Brent Henninger. And uh, we're going to give this paddle, tie, paddle tail a try. See there is some bait out there. See if we maybe get hooked up on a snook or tarpon out there to give it a try. It's been a big difference from the st like two days ago where there was nothing but six, seven foot seas. So we're going to try to fish this area, see what we can do real quick, see maybe if we can hook up, up on the tarpon. It is low tide, you know, I usually hate. Look at that. Look at that. Look, first time. First cast. Look at this little snuck. Right on the head edger. Right there. Nice little snook. Look at that. Right there. Woohoo. Quick release. But not a bad little snook. See if we can get him. Oh. See you later. <laughs> that was. Literally the first cast. Little baby guy. Sometimes they're just pouring on on these little baits. So you gotta switch it up. You know I'm a Missouri guy, but look at that, another hit right there, right in the first drop. This is what they're just eating. You don't have to cast it out very far. Just bring it in nice and slow. Work that trough. They're shooting glass minis. You like this light. You like this nice and clear bait. Looks like a glass minnow. And I can't say it enough, Brent makes, Brent is born and raised here and he makes a great lure. Great soft, soft rubber bait. And everybody's making front soft rubber baits now, but when you have a hometown guy, you gotta support him. There's rocks right in front of me. Now guys, everybody gets hang up. You gotta work the bait nice and slow. Not a super fast retrieve. Just bring it in nice and slow. Get your rod tip up. I mean, fish that sucker all the way to the shore. They keep popping it right there. 
the second one I missed. I'm just gonna work it again. See if I can just get a smaller snook out of there. So you have to keep a rod tip up. Woo! This kid, every time they're just getting bumped. Getting sliced. And... See out there, spinner shark. I like this murky water too. Later, you just bring it in a nice and slow. That sucker nice and slow. Work it right in that trough right there. when this rain stays off but it is coming pretty quick see them a little base right there they just work it through there working through that area Put that rod tip up Maybe just the rocks there. Nice fish. This lure is on fire today. Nice jack or mail. Nice jack. Destroyed that sucker right there. Look at that. Nice. Let's flip this over. I can put it back in business, bro. Nice little jack or mail though. I said you gotta match the hatch now see there's a little bit of bait ball that coming through right now but they're in the tinier sizes i don't know if you can see with the gopro because i know it's hard to see they just come right right there so what you want to do is you want to cast outside the school and then bring it in see if there's any tarpon tarpon usually bust through it if they're if they're feeding heavy right there Not a big school. Start it right off like that. Get out there again. You can hear the thunder rug and rolling in. Chase me off the beach. to stick here as much as I can. Hopefully this goes a little bit south of us. I don't 
see any tarpon really popping right now. It is low tide, so I'm expecting the next few hours when the tide starts coming in, it'll be a lot better. Now stay tuned, let's see if we can get some more fish off of the same lure.